What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Mark Bacon Keipel back again and today we're going to talk about something that I found on the internet today about Fortnite Battle Royale. So in Fortnite the developers have a vault where they put old weapons that they feel don't fit the game or are too overpowered or don't get used at all. Recently there's been some talks on the internet about what weapons that they want to bring back and what they should never bring back and as of today i found out that they are going to be bringing back two weapons from the vault that's right two weapons that were either already way too good or were just not good enough and weren't used so i'm going to go over which weapons are going to be coming back out of the vault so the first weapon that's going to be coming out of the vault, which is the main focus of this video, is going to be the Guided Missile. That's right. The Guided Missile, which was so overpowered and made you turtle up instantly, or <laughs> you're dead. So I found this article on Forbes.com and I'll try to put the link down in the description box. The fun but controversial guided missile weapon is returning to Fortnite Battle Royale in, in the very near future according to Epic Games. The guided missile was definitely an overpowered weapon before it was vaulted, but it's coming back with some changes. It's not going to be the same exact weapon, there's going to be a little bit of changes to it, so hopefully it's not going to be so crazy that it's game breaking. So let's check out what has changed. They've reduced movement skills. They've reduced the turn radius, they've reduced damage, and it has better mouse and keyboard controls for those on PC, and the ammo is now capped at 12 instead of uh, 99 or 100 back when it first came out. So it's going to be a lot less spammed than it was, and it seems to me that it's going to be used kind of like a UAV in Call of Duty. I'm just scouting out and seeing where the people are. So it'd be really good for squads um, and solos and duos. It'd be really good just to see where they are and maybe get a little bit of damage to them. And from what it seems, it probably won't be killing people. Um, so that's the change that they made. And let me just read through the rest of this article. This should at the very least make the guided missile a slightly less frustrating weapon to go up against. Though I wonder if ammo should be capped even lower. You can wreck a lot of havoc with 12 rockets. I have mixed feelings about this particular weapon. It can be a lot of fun and makes for some entertaining streams and gameplay videos, but sometimes it feels like there are simply too many explosive items in general in this game. I guess we'll see if changes are enough of a nerf. With the changes that they made to the guided missile, do you guys think that it's going to be as overpowered as it was, or it's actually going to fit into the game and it won't make everyone turtle up instantly. Now the second weapon that is supposedly going to be coming out of the vault is going to be the crossbow. But it's not going to be the same exact crossbow that we're used to. It's now going to come in an epic rarity and it's going to be an explosive crossbow. Shoots an arrow with an explosive tip, your enemy's worst nightmare. So what it seems like, it's going to basically be like a sticky grenade, but just in a launcher basically and it's exactly like the uh, crossbow from Call of Duty if any of you guys played Call of Duty you know how it is um, you shoot it you stick them and then it explodes so I think that'll be really good for breaking bases and if you hit somebody it should do really good damage to them and allow you to push them pretty well and that's all that I found about the crossbow but it's in the game files that it's going to be returning so with those changes to it, do you guys like the new crossbow or do you guys still prefer the old crossbow? So, with those two weapons coming out of the vault, what do you guys think about these changes that they made to the weapons or are going to change? Are you guys excited for these weapons to come back? Are you guys angry that they're coming back? Let me know in the comments down below. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share the video, do all the good things. Thanks again for watching this video, guys. I'm Mark Bacon Kaipo. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.